What's going on everybody and welcome. If you're watching this video right now, it's because you know what's going on in the markets. Some of us, we've been waiting years now. I told you, pace off, crypto.com holders, you're watching right now the price, the volume, the news, the energy. We're not gonna waste any second right now. And I'm gonna tell you the latest, plus why are the prices rallying? Why are we so excited? Whether we're pumping or not, this is the way that we normally feel in my case, even when it's down and bearish, that's when you buy, that's when you get in. Right now, let me be the first one to tell you one of the greatest truths. This is not the bull market. This is not the bull market. This is still accumulation phase. Bitcoin will truly start rallying to prices we haven't discovered in years past $32,000. If you're holding right now Kronos, it's going from five cents to mid five cents, approaching six cents, it's not there yet. And a lot of people are gonna say, Oscar, that is not enough. But I gotta tell you, it is, it is on a good pace. It is steady growing. Binance closing their cards, remember? Crypto.com, I've said it. Listen to me. I've said, listen to the Crow fam. This is the perfect opportunity for crypto.com to add more perks, promos. That's what they did just did it earlier. Chris, Eric, crypto.com sharing. They knew it was the right move. EU users can now enjoy a little bit of a percentage and more promos just for them because they need that market share. And the price of Kronos, same as Solana, Chainlink, and other ones is rallying. Bitcoin 4.5% or so. Kronos in the volume over 80 to 90% right now. People are buying. And guess what? I, I would love to show you, but you've got a whale alert on Twitter, on X. Someone bought millions of Chrome. They changed from a wallet to crypto.com. That just happened. That happened and it's incredible because it means that we have whales that are willing and able to move around their tokens and to even buy as well. I'm happy to what's going on right now. So let me tell you, this can also be a bull trap. I gotta be honest with you guys. This is not gonna be an easy cakewalk to 10 cents. That is left for pre and post halving. That is not gonna be the bull market even the bull market is gonna really start in 2024, 2025. This is just accumulation phase as we wait for the Bitcoin ETF's approval. That's it. What I've just said is very important because the Bitcoin ETF's approval are gonna trigger the complete and total end of the crypto bear market and the beginning of the next phase, which is the bull, but in the pre-bull market, right? Which is the accumulation phase where Bitcoin waits for the Bitcoin, um, Bitcoin halving and starts about from 40,000 and above. That's it. Because that's what's really going on. The shorts, the longs, they're, you know, out of their positions. And I'm looking at everything right now and more people are starting to come on YouTube, more people are starting to come on Twitter subscribers are rising means that consumer confidence in investing in crypto everybody i think it's growing it can all come down to to a certain extent meaning we're not just going to rally to the moon we have to go little by little because that's the reason of the bull pennant we grow we come down we grow we come down since yesterday in the live that we were talking we had an amazing sunday night live with a lot of people because I just got the chance to witness how Bitcoin went from high 30s to 31 or so. It was just beautiful. 29 to 30 and beyond, meaning and indicating that someone knows something, that the Bitcoin ETFs approval are happening somewhat soon. And once one of them finally releases to the public, multiple of them are going to be saying yes. The SEC commissioner, I tweeted earlier how they've said, she said that the Bitcoin ETFs approach should have been done years ago, about five years ago. That means 
that we're in this time, guys, of just waiting for the right time. So I'll control it. So when it comes to crypto.com, well, we need to have immediate price appreciation. What does that mean? The last time crypto.com was in a consolidation stage for a major resistance was June 2023. That was six cents. So since summer of 2023, all the way to right now, we have gone under six cents and that's it. Five and four, five and four, five and four. We're finally breaking free and rallying a little bit, not by a lot, but by a little bit. And it's good. People are bullish. People are very happy. We're tweeting, we're posting, we're letting everybody know. So major resistance for crypto.com Kronos, guys, six cents. We need to break that. We may retrace a bit, but we need to get out of the five cents finally. Once we are passing that five to the six, six to the seven is gonna be much easier. And then seven to the 10, that's not gonna be too much of a problem as we continue being bullish. But you know what? I'm really excited that October didn't disappoint because I was actually having my questions already. Two weeks ago or so, it was boring. It was still under 27. But that fake news for, from Cointelegraph kind of helped put everybody on the same page when it comes to Bitcoin ETFs. And that's it. Obviously, that is the major question at, uh, you know, at hand. Uh, winning the SEC, getting the ETFs approved. And after that, guys, altcoins are going to rally. I mean, we know how much Chainlink rallied. Solana. Chainlink did about 40%. Solana did also great. It was, it's insane. Kronos, can Kronos do it? Answer, yes. So from five cents can go all the way to seven cents, just like that. And that's when most of my videos, just like this one, they're gonna do very well because we've been talking about Kronos for such a long time. People are not paying attention until it's green and they decide to buy. And guess what? Some whales, They've been buying at four and five, they're gonna sell. You cannot do anything about it. But people, long-term investors, that have been buying at five, six, seven, eight, ten, they're waiting, not for a 25, 10, 40% re, you know, gain. They're waiting for the $1. They're waiting for the 50 cents. They're waiting for the much higher price targets because they wanna see bigger wealth in their portfolio. Plus, you gotta pay taxes. So. If you wait a little bit longer, whether whether you bought it this year or last year, you can pass that time frame so you don't pay short-term taxes, right? The long-term is less and you keep more of that money. It's all happening, everybody. And I'm super excited to see the company listen to what Binance is doing and attack going the offense. So more people come to crypto.com, the price rallying, Bitcoin rallying. We have levels of resistance ahead, 32,000. And six cents once one of them breaks get your parachute because we're going much higher i'll see you next time everybody thanks for watching like and subscribe i'm ready peace